So recently, movie fans were hit with some surprising and disappointing news. On Monday, Sony announced that the release date for Morbius had been delayed once again with the highly anticipated film now set to release on April 1st instead of January 28th. No specific reason was immediately given for the shift in the release date, and this is far from the first time that the film has been rescheduled. The film was rescheduled at least three other times before, and while fans are speculating as to the reason for this latest delay, another question is sparking and starting to bubble up, which is, are more box office delays going to occur this year? Well, the short answer is, it depends. It depends on various reasons. One is because of the current uh, COVID-19 cases uh, surging. Uh, it is very possible that we will see some additional delays and reschedules of films. Uh, the cases of COVID-19 are surging in various areas of the country, which is starting to have major impact in the healthcare system. Uh, thousands of flights have been canceled in the past week due to, you know, staff members getting COVID. And they even started to, uh, they were considering like canceling the Grammy Awards, which is uh, scheduled for January 31st as well. So a lot of stuff is going on with COVID and that's impacting you know a lot of things making things delay get canceled and whatnot well if morbius is just the first film to be shifted due to the COVID cases the next question is what other films are likely to get pushed as well so reporters have stated that this wave of the pandemic is likely to peak at the end of january therefore we're probably looking at films set for january and february releases that are more that are most likely to be delayed so this would include films like Scream, which is set to release on January 14th, Jackass Forever, which is uh, currently set for February 4th, uh, and Uncharted, which is uh, set to release February 11th. Um, a lot of these are highly anticipated. Um, me personally, I'm looking forward to Uncharted and Scream because I'm a Tom Holland fan and then I watched all the other Scream movies, so I'm looking forward to them coming out. Uh, movies a bit later out to look into is like uh, the Batman, which is set to release on March 4th. Doctor Strange and Multiverse, Multiverse of Madness, which is set to uh, release in May. Um, so those two movies, I am they, I think they're more likely safe where they're at thus far. Um, but we just got to wait and see what happens uh, in due time, because it is possible that those can get delayed as well uh, if things don't get better. Um, and then at this point, the reason for Morbius delay is pure speculation. Um, it's, so it's not, it's not a guarantee that, oh, because of COVID surges, that's the reason why it's getting delayed. But it's a likely factor, though, because of everything that's been happening. Um, and also, with the, cur the, the cases surging up, that's also going to affect the success of Spider-Man No Way Home. Um, but... Another reason why they could delay it is because Sony might just want to give its films a bit of wiggle room in between, you know, film drops. Maybe they want to have a, a, a open window for Spider-Man No Way Home to accumulate more money to get closer and closer to that $2 billion mark. That is a possibility. I've, I've seen it happen with different franchises. There's nothing wrong with that, actually. Um, or it could be delayed for additional post-production reasons. Whatever the reason is, um, we've learned in the past two years that it's important to remain flexible when it comes to movie release dates and be patient as well. Um, the movies we crave will eventually make it to the screen and we'll be there to to watch them regardless. So for me, like whether Morbius comes out January, February, June, or next year, I'm gonna be set to go see it. I'm gonna have my money off the side to make sure I go get my popcorn, my you know nachos and whatnot, and I'm gonna go watch it. <laughs> So does the latest Morbius release date shift mean that more box office delays are on the way? Yeah, let me know down in the comments what you all think. Uh, and what and if so, what movies you think that what movies you think are going to get delayed uh, in 2022? So yeah, let me know down in the comments and uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one.